what do we got going today? Well, it looks like we got our Sawzall here. And uh, we're gonna go ahead and, uh, actually the Sawzall or Cage Remover 2000. We're gonna go ahead and get in here and I'm gonna zip there, get this uh, ankle biter out of the way and pull this. So I'm gonna try and remove it up here at the top of the cage and get this piece out of here. Let's get out of here. That's what we're doing. I'm uh, tired of it and I don't need it and we're gonna get rid of it. So let's get moving. I think it's loose. Woo! That was a bit of a pain in the booty. It's still a little off. Alright, try not to jack now the nut. No scratches. Here we go. I can make this into a rack to paint my stuff with. Thank you. Oh yeah. Oh yeah? Let's take a look and see. Oh man, look at all the room we got for activities. Whee! Much, much better. All right, I gotta get these fellers out of here so I'm gonna have to pull the hood and uh, get to hack in there but man what a difference already oops sorry I'll get these knocked out Woo! it's hot in here I'm just saying she go Okay, now it looks like we got just these bar here. So I need to hack her down here because eventually I'm gonna put new plates on here and re-weld when I uh, decide to go real fast again. But it looks like we gotta relocate this isolator. Uh, not quite sure where I'll relocate that, but maybe I have to make another plate. Uh, let's see, you just got the wire for that. Okay. And yes, I need a new a new fan. Ah, sorry, trying to get around the car. I need a new uh, radiator hose. Well, that looks a little smashed. But yeah, that ain't that ain't gonna fly for what I'm doing. And that fan's gotta go. So this guy here. What else do we got? What all do we got hooked here? We just have. Wow, that's pretty. We just got these two zip ties and the looks like the temp sensor for the exhaust. So, yep, let's hack this one out in here, pull that out, give yourself some more room up in here. Quit talking and get to work and geez. Oh, would you look at that. It's gone. Yep, there you go. Got to figure out how I'm going to uh, support this, which after thinking about it, I'm going to rip all this out anyway because it's part of the fuel system, so not a problem because we're getting rid of that. We're getting rid of everything. We're going to redo all of it, and they have one wire I had to snip to that just runs up to the headlights in here. Not a big deal. Let's look over on this side and see what all we got to fix up now that I hack these things out. Let's take a look. Oh, look at that. It's gone. Uh, let's see. Yeah, like I said, we just got our one uh, temp sensor for the exhaust. And that's it. 
So pretty simple, and I'd rather take and reroute this stuff in here along the fender and then just have it beep. But I'll come up with that once we get everything set up. But now we got a nice hole here. That's wonderful. But we had room before for activities. Check this out. Oh, look at that. Yep. We got some holes in the dash, but now I can at least get in here and work on stuff. Get this thing ready. We still have the back part of the cage. We still got what we need for a 10 second car. But if I ever want to do it, I can redo it and re-weld it. You guys saw some of the welds. We got to redo it either way, but yeah, baby, we're making progress on the dart. Hell yeah. This time on Unsolved Mysteries, we take off the valve camera to find out what valve train is in this thing. All right, here we go. Let's pop this thing off and see what's under here. I have no idea what we're gonna find. I like it. Very happy. Oh, baby. Lucky, lucky. We got some cranes. Ooh. What do we got here? They are 6'4, 1.5. Oh, yeah. Very, very, very nice. I uh, need to check my valve lash, but we got oil up here. That's a good thing. I get to check all the push rods oh yeah baby very nice I'm very very happy you never know how somebody does a build and they put money in the right places on this machine so very happy oh yeah that's pretty even matches the color kind of awesome awesome up next oh what is this we got some exhaust parts in so we're gonna go and weld up some exhaust get this thing fixed up and then uh, put in that new fuel cell we got so hope you guys are enjoying the build so far got a lot to do but we're getting it done i appreciate all your support thank you so much